If you want to use your Stadia controller with your PC or your Android device, you have to follow those steps. So go to this link, stadia.google.com slash controller. And then switch to Bluetooth mode. You can check if your, uh, your controller is already updated to, to use it with uh, Windows or you can switch directly so we will check here i accept start and now you have to plug your stadia controller into your computer with a usb cable you can use the cable that uh, that came with uh, the stadia controller or any another cable so plug the USB cable to your computer and to your Stadia. Okay. Next step, continue. Allow Chrome to verify allow connection. Your controller is in Stadia Wi-Fi mode so you have to switch it to Bluetooth mode okay switch to Bluetooth mode unlock your Stadia controller your controller needs to be unlocked to download updates follow these steps instructions so the first one is to unplug your controller to power off it okay like this and then the second step hold the this button three dots button while plugging in your controller okay so i hold it and i plug it again okay and the third step is to press like here okay so let's do it this and this this and this there won't be any controller feedback go to the next step to confirm it unlocked next step And now, download Bluetooth mode update. Select your controller in the uh, Chrome device. List again. Okay, hello. Select it here. And connection. Download complete. Uh, you are almost done. Go to the final step to install the latest version of Bluetooth mod on your controller. Next step here. Allow Chrome to install USB and connection. One more time, select your controller in the Chrome device list, then click connect installation will start automatically and should only take a minute the latest bluetooth mode update is installed game on your controller is in bluetooth mode and can pair to bluetooth devices you can now unplug your controller like you can see here and uh, plug it with your computer, Android. You can learn how to pair with Bluetooth, as you can see here. Next, what the status light means.
flashing orange pairing mode visible to other devices flashing white connecting to last pair device and solid white connected to a device okay let's see now if we can connect this controller to my computer uh, it's it's important to know that you can use uh, your controller with USB cable directly or with Bluetooth mode now the Bluetooth mode is BLE uh, Bluetooth low energy let's see if uh, it works I have to go to Bluetooth add new device Bluetooth and we start the pairing mode Stadia is here and you have to click quickly on Stadia good uh, and now my controller is connected with my computer nice now I can use it to play games I can also use USB cable to play like this okay let's let's try now to connect it to my phone so i have to analyze with my comp with my phone okay and put it on pairing mode again and it's here okay and the controller is connected with my phone you can see here that i can use it on my phone so thank you for watching i hope that uh, this video was helpful for you Please like, share and subscribe. And if you have any question, you can let it on the comments below this video. Goodbye.